Jeez, out here. We out here, just the crib. Rich baby, I got what you need. It's easy season. Welcome back to the channel for a brand new daily vlog on Sneaker Talk. We're here in downtown Toronto from my brand new condo. If you guys missed the last vlog, check it out. I'll leave a link down below. I have a few of my friends with me right now. We got we got Cos Elmo right here. We got Sonic the Hedgehog. And we also have my boy Jollibee as well. Probably one of my favorite one of my favorite plushies I have. We have the whole crew here, and we also have my favorite photographer in the world too. We got Dougie, Douglas, Portraits by Douglas on Instagram. Follow him if you guys wanna see some amazing portraits. He also shoots a lot, of, a lot of pretty ladies as well. So if you wanna bless your feet, he's got you covered. He takes some of the best photos on my Instagram account. So like, if you ever wanna, if you're like curious, yo, who took that? Or like, if the photo looks better than normal, like compared to what I usually post, He's probably the mastermind behind the camera. But yo, today we uh, finally have everything moved in. Last night, I had a few of my cousins over. Condo tour, apartment tour, very, very soon. But yesterday, I got my uh, my couch in right here. Big, thick couch. And then my uh, computer desk as well, right below. Today's a fun, fun day because we're gonna be doing some Yeezy hunting. I really like Yeezy hunting in downtown Toronto because a lot of these sneaker stores are located really, really close to each other. So it's super, super convenient. And in Canada, as you guys know, it is freezing cold in the winter. The less time I have to spend going from store to store, the better. Now, if you guys don't know, today they're dropping three different Yeezys. They're all regional exclusives like they have been in the past uh, where they did like the clay and the hyperspace and all those. This time around, the three colorways are the Earth, the Flax, and the Tail Light. So North America has the Earth and it basically is like an all brown Yeezy Boost 350 V2 with that sort of like static vibe you guys know where it has that little stripe on the side you can sort of see through. Now if you're in Europe you're gonna be getting the Tail Light Yeezy Boost 350 today and those ones are gray with an orange back so it's called the Tail Light for a good reason and I really like them. And then the last colorway, the Flax, is the colorway of Yeezys that my Filipinos are gonna get because this release is for Asia, Africa, and uh, somewhere else. They're kind of like a fusion of the Yeezy Boost 350 V2 Butter and the Stat. Now my favorite, hmm, I'm not too sure, but let me know in the poll in the top right hand corner right now, which colorway do you guys like the most? The uh, Tail Light, the Flax, or the Earth? I'm not too sure how limited these were, but I'm hoping we're able to grab a pair and maybe we can get a few to give away as well. Maybe just hold and flip later on. All right, so we just pulled up to the Eden Center right now, but the very first store we're gonna go to is the Adidas store outside at Young and Dundas. So once we're done there, we're gonna go to the Eden Center and see which stores here have the Adidas Yeezys because uh, there's like five of them here. So we're all done at Adidas store. Unfortunately, they didn't have the Yeezys there, but they did advertise it available on their app, which I took a hat. I had. I took a fat L on. Let's put my Believe guy in the back. But uh, but yeah, I took a fat L on the app. I got lucky on the Zebra restock, but just no uh, no Earth Yeezys today. But if you guys got lucky, let me know in the comments down below if you did end up buying the Yeezys in your region. With that said, I want to check out the Jordan store real quick because uh, Full Locker just announced that there's going to be a two-day raffle for the Pine Green Air Jordan 1s for Tuesday and Monday. The sneakers are dropping on Saturday. But the Jordan store, we don't know if it's going to be first come, first serve or raffle. So we'll quickly check in. If you guys want to see what's available at the Jordan store right now, check out yesterday's vlog. Again, I'll leave a link down below. But we'll check in on the Pine Greens, and then we're going to head over to the Eden Center. All right, so we checked in with the employees at the Jordan store, 306 Young, and they can not officially confirm it's going to be a raffle, but they said it's a 95% chance it will be a raffle, just like Foot Locker. So we'll see in uh, we'll see on Monday if it's going to be a raffle. But stay tuned to my IG stories for the real-time updates. That's the quickest place I can update you guys on all these sneaker releases downtown. All right, next up, let's get up the Eden Center. All right, so the very first store we're gonna check out inside of Eden Center is the Champ Sports now. Can't really film in here, I'll probably use my iPhone, so let's see what we can find. So the very first store was a success. We got one pair, size 10, my own personal size. I'll have a review on these 
tomorrow. So stay tuned if you guys are looking into these 350 V2s, the Earthed ones, the North American exclusive. Subscribe, hit that red button down below, all that good stuff. But next up, we're gonna hit up Full Locker and Foot Action. See if we can get some pairs there. I'll probably get some other sizes other than my own so I can sell them uh, to you guys or do a giveaway. So if you guys haven't yet followed me on Instagram, it's at SneakerTalksCA. Follow your boy. All right, so Full Locker, no luck there. They had no Yeezys at all. Usually that Full Locker has a bunch after the, the restocks and stuff. Like when I was there for the Static and Zebra restocks, they had a ton of them, but no Earth Yeezy Boost 350 V2s at Full Locker. But next up, we have Foot Action, and I've always been pretty lucky when it comes to Yeezy sitting here at Foot Action. So let's go inside and check it out. Foot Action has my back as usual. They have a bunch of pairs, a bunch of sizes left. So Foot Action is probably the best spot to go to if you're looking for these Earth Yeezys right now. But as I told you guys in the past, the employees at Foot Action, they always have the best shoes. So I'm gonna see if I can ask a few of them to get their shoes on camera and then we'll cut to some Yeezy talk right after. All right, so we're all done at Foot Action. Now it's time to head back to the crib Show you guys these Yeezy Boost 350 V2 Earths up close and personal. Also, it turns out these Yeezys were a bit more limited than people anticipated. Only five stores in Toronto got them. The uh, one of the employees at Foot Action were telling me that not all the Foot Lockers got them, and some people thought it was going to be like a huge, huge GR like that. So the Foot Locker that was inside of Eden Center that we went to that didn't have them, that's just because they never got them to begin with. So yeah, I predict that the resale for these Yeezys are going to go up over the summer months and, and next fall. For now, I think they're going to be around retail at least for the first couple of months. And again, Foot Action employees killed it with what they had on feet. But yeah, let's get back home and show you guys some Yeezys. I'm just playing. I'm not I'm not gonna kick down the Yeezys again. No, that, that was a bit dramatic at the start of this vlog. Baby, I got what you need. But yo, if you guys are enjoying the video, of course, smash that like button down below. We're gonna take a quick little look at the brand new Adidas Yeezy Boost 350 V2 Earth colorway. So as I mentioned earlier, this is a North American exclusive colorway. I will be doing an in-depth review later tomorrow, so stay tuned for that. I picked up two pairs today, but they are sitting at stores like Foot Action and Champs. And one thing I noticed that both stores no longer do anymore is in the past on like social media and stuff, you would see people take photos of like the Yeezy boxes stacked up and it's still people, people still do this when it comes to like new Air Jordan releases. You go to the store and see them stacked behind the counter and it basically just says, yo, these are sitting, these are bricks, people come buy them. Lately, at least in terms of the Earth colorway, one thing I noticed was no stores had Yeezy boxes on display in mass quantities. So that is like a new a new thing when it comes to Yeezys. I wanna say it's like the truth about the new Yeezys is that they're just not going to advertise how much they have left because again, Yeezys were so popular because they were very hyped and limited. So these days with them not being as hyped, not as limited, it's really hard to, to gauge you know, how how much demand there is uh, if, if there isn't Yeezys selling out all the time at retail. But anyways, uh, we have two pairs here. This is a size 9.5. Now, I personally prefer wearing a size 10 in my Yeezys. So if this video can get 2,000 thumbs up within two weeks, we will give this pair away on YouTube. And if you guys wanna increase your odds at winning my giveaways, I also have two other platforms I post on a ton. Instagram and Facebook. So drop me a follow. It's at SneakerTalkCA over on Instagram and it's also at SneakerTalkCA on Facebook. So here is the uh, the tag because I am from Canada. These are the numbers that they do show, but I believe international pairs or American pairs have like different numbers. They don't have six, six different numbers here. Here's the tag because people think all my shoes are fake even if I buy them in a vlog. It doesn't want to focus. There we go. There we go. Hoping it has that new Yeezy smell. The Yeezy box did not fart this time. They, use, they usually fart. Um, all right, here we go. Let's do the little smell check. Not quite as amazing as an Air Jordan 1 smell, let's face it, but still really clean. I mean, I'd hope so. They are brand new. These are the Yeezy Boost 350 V2 Earth colorway. Now, excuse the sort of orangish lighting on the one side and the blue, uh, bluish lighting on the other. Still working out my lighting scenario when it comes to this, this room because, you know, still setting it up, still getting used to living here on my own. So I'll have my studio lights very, very soon to have more consistent like white lighting. But in terms of just a shoe up close and personal, I gotta say, these are, these are dope. 
I think these will be one of the more underrated Yeezys come the next few years. People are gonna look back on this release and be like, damn, I wish I caught those. Very, very simple Yeezy to wear. It's this all brown, sort of like a chocolatey brown upper. If you are a fan of the statics, those those Yeezys uh, that have like the stripe down the side, the sort, sort of like semi-translucent, you'll probably like these sneakers. I don't really see too many all brown sneakers. It's not something I'm really used to seeing. So when it comes to this colorway, definitely more of a fall winter type of shoe, not something I expect to see many, many people wear in the spring and summer months. And one thing that does surprise me when it comes to these Yeezys is that it's like an all brown upper, but then they have a random hit of yellow on the outsole. Like, take a look. It's just like, bam, all up in your face is yellow. But you're only going to see it if you're looking at the bottom of the shoe. And let's face it, that's like never. So they could have honestly kept it black or white or brown or just they could have kept it brown but they went for yellow i don't know why but yeah overall the quality materials and i want to say like the uh the quality control it's on point for these yeezys it has the full prime net upper and uh, yeah i don't really want to get into too much detail about these yeezys because i will be having an in-depth review later on the channel tomorrow so subscribe to this channel hit that red button down below and subscribe to my second youtube channel sneaker talk 365 for daily sneaker reviews once i can start posting on there with that said let me know in the comments down below if you made it to the end of the video which yeezy boost 350 v2 you guys like the most from this pack we of course have the tail lights which were the european exclusive we have the flax which were the asia exclusive and we have the earth which is the north american exclusive and i'll catch you guys in the next video i love you guys it feels great to be back daily vlogging and uh yeah new chapter of my life so happy to share it with you guys 2000 likes on this video in two weeks and we will give away my size 9.5 pair all right see you guys later peace